Hello friends, welcome to my channel Civil Engineering Forum. Today we are going to study the topic foundation, its purpose and types under the subject construction technology. So basically I would be briefing you regarding foundation in construction or rather we would say in civil engineering and would be getting into three important questions. That is what is foundation, what are its purpose or functions we can say and what are the basic types of foundation for any structure. So don't miss this lecture if you want answers to these three questions which are at most important part of construction technology. So now starting with the introductory part we would see what is foundation at first. That was our first question. It is the lowest part of a structure below the ground level which is in direct contact with the ground and transmits all the load to the ground. As shown over here a diagram of the most common type of foundation is glimpsed over here which shows its geometry and load transfer mechanism which is coming from the superstructure and it can be understood very easily from this figure. And as per the statement given over here, this is the lowermost part of the structure below the ground level, rather we can say the lowermost part of the building component and it is in the direct contact with the ground and transmits the weight which in technical terms we can say load of the superstructure vertically to the ground. As shown over here, this is the load coming from the superstructure vertically downwards and this is the reaction shown which our foundation returns in order to keep our structure stable. So then we'll come to our next question that is what are the purpose of providing this foundation? So first at your level you can just guess the function of this foundation where this is the column and this is the foundation which is followed by it. And we can see how the column is resting on this flat slab which is the most common type of foundation and it is below the ground level. So this is what our first point explains to take the structure deep into the ground and thus increase its stability and preventing its overturning. So this is the first most purpose of providing the foundation where we can take our structure deep into the ground and in this way we can keep it stable and uh, ultimately this stability can prevent the overturning of the structure. And so basically we can say that deeper is the foundation, safer is our structure. Then going to the second point, its purpose is to prevent unequal settlement. So sometimes it's possible that our structure has been settled on one side compared to that on the other side. So this may be due to some fault in the foundation or a drastical reduction in the soil bearing capacity. So if we provide firm and safe foundation, we can prevent unequal settlement. And third and the last point which we need to discuss for the purpose of providing the foundation is to distribute the load on a larger surface area. That is by looking at this figure we can understand this point load has been converted into the area load and uh, it is distributed in a larger surface area. And uh, in this way punching effect on the soil due to this column can be prevented and this is the main purpose we are distributing the load. So these were the three main purpose of providing this foundation though we can discuss a lot more on this topic but we'll continue with our next topic that is our question what are the types of foundation. So at the basic level foundations are divided into two types that is shallow foundation and deep foundation. There is still a detailed classification on each foundation but at first we'll understand both of this basic foundation where the first is shallow foundation. So if the depth of footing that is D, here I have shown the depth of the footing and it is symbolized by capital D. If this is less than or equal to its width, this is the width of the footing, then we can say it as a shallow foundation. And if we discuss regarding the types of shallow foundation, then these five types are there, spread footing, combined footing, scrap footing, raft or mat foundation and grillage foundation where each of this foundation will be explained in detail in my upcoming lectures. Then our next type is deep foundation. So opposite to that of the shallow foundation, if the depth of the footing D, here I have shown the depth of the footing is more than its width. So here the difference is here the depth is more than the width. So it is called a deep foundation. And the three basic types of uh, deep foundations are pile foundation, cations or we can say well foundation and the third one is coffer dam. And these three will also be explained in my upcoming lectures. So thank you for watching and stay tuned.